required to get them all into this molecule chamber. It takes away their powers, see? And turns them into ordinary human beings. Now, if you could... Don't go in there, General. It's a trap. Luther, you poisonous snake! That's a molecule chamber. It makes people like you into people like me. You've done well, Lex Luthor. General, um, the crystal there uh, activates the mechanism. Lex Luthor. Lex Luthor, ruler of Australia, activate the machine. Ruler of Australia, activate the machine. <laughs> Thank you. With your permission. And now, finally. Take my hand. Swear eternal loyalty to Zart. from 1980 and can you believe I'm presuming that Lex Luthor is Rupert Murdoch um, leader of the ruler of Australia and he is the one that basically destroys or tries to um, be um, <laughs> evil and uh, work against Superman um, now you've got to think about you know the propaganda and all of this um, look at what happened with all of the you know the problems in Melbourne for the whole last three years and now Dictator Dan is gone. Um, you know, this is this is just a bit insane if you ask me, um, to see all of this. Once again, you're in the general trap. You're um, a poisonous snake. Um, expectation of the future. It makes people like you. And that's Rupert Murdoch. Into people like um, me. I did a bit of digging. You've done well. some talk at the time that yeah, he was the, um, you know, the, the uh, crystal there uh, activates the mechanism and all that type of rubbish. Lex Luthor. Um, Ruler of Australia. Century, 21st century Activate. or 20th century Fox. 21st century Fox because now we're in a new, um, a new century. Um, you know, all of that. So to actually see it unfolding in front of our eyes. Um, and it's what, how many years? 1980, so that's what, 43 years. 43 years later. Um, so yeah, I was, in, I was in primary school when the movie came out. Um, and to see all of this, it's, it really drew my head in. And to find out that Rupert Murdoch, he actually denounced his Australian citizenship. 
Yeah, he threw it away so that he could make money in the US. If that doesn't tell you that money is more important to him than his own birth country and his own citizenship, it means nothing to him. Um, and all the ice cave and everything, um, think about what's happening with our sky and all the crystals in the sky, um, all the chemtrails, all that type of stuff. It, it isn't a coincidence, it is all in some way linked together. And um, I'm finding it really quite fascinating um, how ignorant people are. You know, they have to take away, he, you know, Lex Luthor thinks that he's so smart, but Spider Man beats him and they, it takes all their power away and they fall then into the abyss. And then it's like the fallen angels. It is almost like, you know, um, part of um, the Bible coming true. You know, you don't betray people, don't betray yourself. And to hear all of this, look, Lex Luthor, yes, they're saying it could be. Um, he's just a character, um, but Rupert Murdoch, he threw away, not even denouncing, he threw away his Australian citizenship. Wow, so he could expand his media company in America. If that doesn't tell you what an asshole that man is, I don't know what to say. But I'm going to um, look at the media side of things because um, there's, there's a bit more I'm going to dig into this. Um, it's a bit more interesting, a bit more fascinating when doing about politics. Um, it's a bit depressing. Um, so if you can look at the media, because you know they're using that as a, a way, a, a back door to getting into children's minds through predictive programming, which is what this is. It's a predictive programming video uh, for entertainment purposes only. And um, yeah, and we haven't even got to the one that I want to do, and I will be adding it. Um, and hopefully put it in here because it's once again think about what's happening with a certain country in Ukraine and what's happening there and all this talk of you know political um, parties that might be still around that people say that we were defeated back in the 1940s um, in World War II mm, but apparently it never was still in that war it never stopped it just moved from one place to another and certain people in this um, group um, went to countries like Canada, Australia, New Zealand and especially America and ended up in NASA um, because they had a lot of skills um, and they knew how to do stuff. Yeah, and also don't forget about Antarctica and think about the whole Superman thing. Maybe that is the back door to Antarctica. All of that there and I really think that is the, the case. Um, we know that, you know, it is the ice cave down there um, and I, I don't know what else to say. Um, but anyway, tell me what you think, and um, yeah, and so it's probably going to be a bit of rambling um, because there's just so much to, to focus on. But anyway, Godspeed to all. Godspeed. Yes,